Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to another brand new video. In this video I'm actually gonna show you guys my number one portfolio when it comes to crypto. But before you watch this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel, give this video a like if you like it and turn on the notification bell so you can receive my content on a daily basis. Having said that, I want you guys to know that I am not a financial advisor, I do not advise anybody to take any financial actions on any platform or any cryptocurrency that I talk about. This is mainly myself talking about my journey in crypto and my losses and my earnings. So make sure to always conduct your own research before doing any, before making any financial decisions on anything, on anything that I talk about. Having said that, um, my number one uh, cryptocurrency uh, is of course Bitcoin as it is everyone else's. Uh, I don't need to convince you guys about Bitcoin but you know it's pretty self-explanatory. I could hold Bitcoin for a hundred years and I could sleep like a baby because it's Bitcoin. Um, it could fall to 1k, it could fall to whatever, a dollar and I could still hold it because I know it's gonna pump right back up where it was because I've seen it over the years. I'm a, I've been a crypto trader for uh, a few years now, so I have know I know like some uh, common trends, patterns when it comes to uh, trading big cryptocurrencies. So my number one cryptocurrency is Bitcoin, as I said, I've put um, a decent amount of my money on it. Number two cryptocurrency that I've traded at like before I used to trade on a daily basis on Ethereum, it's actually Ethereum, this is my number two cryptocurrency. I used to trade on a daily basis um, in Ethereum like a couple of years ago. Uh, I don't know where, how much it was back then exactly, but I used to trade on a daily basis when I had like a lot of free time and w when I was doing trading on a full time as a full time job. But last year I put a lot of money on it actually, but it drained me a little bit when, especially when it hit 4K. I thought that the target was going to be 10K because that was the that was it, what everyone was saying that the ethereum was gonna was going to hit 10k and i was hoping that it would so i can i could have made like a, a huge amount of money but it didn't actually he went right back down and i still held because i thought that it was just like a slight dump and then the market was gonna go back up but it kept going down and down and down until my the only thing i the only amount I profit margin I benefited from was like um, roughly 20 25 percent but but it was still good it was you know it's this is the 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 thing with crypto you can, you can never know like the the thing no, no matter how no matter how like people just come and talk it's all it's all just theoretical you can never know like what the actual target of a cryptocurrency is and when it's gonna hit the target so all you gotta do is just believe in the cryptocurrency that you're holding and make sure it's actually legit and it's it's not gonna like leave you hanging to dry um, my number three cryptocurrency that I'm holding right now is Polkadot now Polkadot I bought this coin when I was when it was um, 30, I think, when it was 30, back in the bull market. Because, but I was holding it for, you know, long term uh, period of time, of course. But I thought it was gonna, I didn't think it was gonna hold it for a long period of time back then. But uh, it came back down again because I bought at the peak. But again, uh, after I realized that I bought at the peak and there was actually no bull market left, uh, I decided to hold it for long term and not actually sell when it came right back down. So now I'm holding it and it's actually I put a lot of money on it as well. I have like a couple of grands like that, but uh, it's 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 still down. It's still down. like I've lost almost to um, let's say 80, 85 uh, percent of, of the money I put in. But I'm hoping that it would go right up because it's one of the 10 uh, coins recommended for everyone to uh, trade at Polkadot. And my number four cryptocurrency is Chainlink. Of course, Chainlink is a big cryptocurrency in, 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 in crypto and everybody who's a crypto enthusiast knows Chainlink. This is my number four cryptocurrency, which I use to trade at 
like I used to put like very small amounts of money on this on this coin but like after a while I decided to go big I was it was a little stupid of me to do that because that's actually what resulted in me losing uh, a lot of money but I'm still holding I'm still believing I'm a huge believer in crypto and I believe that everything is gonna go right back up because that is the pattern it goes down so that it can go up again it's like the Batman saying we fall so that we can rise <laughs> anyway uh, Chainlink is my number for uh, cryptocurrency these uh, are the four coins that I actually believe in a hundred percent and that I would never sell at at loss like I would never sell these coins at loss because I actually 100% believe in these coins and there are uh, three I guess three of cryptocurrencies that I stopped believing at and wishing that they would just go right to the price where I bought them or so I can just sell on the spot and just get my money back these cryptocurrencies are XRP sorry for xrp fans but i'm tired i'm i'm exhausted i'm so sick of waiting for xrp to to do something man this cryptocurrency is is lazy asf xrp um ontology and uh the other one the other one is not i don't even remember it because i used to have it for a long time at I think uh, no. I think I will just uh, I think I will just remember it later on and write it on the on the screen for you guys to see. But these two coins, XRP and Ontology, man, they they they. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, for so these two cryptocurrencies are the ones that absolutely pissed me off in my entire journey on crypto trading these are the two cryptocurrencies that absolutely pissed me off that got on my nerves so bad that if they were like i i would punch them i would punch them in the face but anyway there is nothing you can do i can't sell at loss i never sell at loss and i do not encourage anybody to sell at loss like because why would you put your money first do not put your emergency money or money that you think you will need in the future in crypto because that's the thing again you can never know when a price is gonna go up or down like i know like there is the bull market there is a dump there is the bear market but again like things could just be it's so unstable it's so volatile like in 24 hours a price could go up 100 percent uh, another currency could go down 100% you guys know what happened to Luna so just use the money that you think you can spare these are piece of advice from my own personal opinion okay so this is not a financial advice by the way this is just based on my own opinion and my experiences so there are two things in the bear market you can do one thing basically uh, it's like regular investing all right so you take a uh, sum of money and you invest it on a regular basis a uh, on a group of cryptocurrencies that you think based on your own research of course that you think will blow up so you take on a regular basis you take a sum of money I don't know like 10% each month 5% depending on your preferences and then you put it in a, a cryptocurrency or a group of cryptocurrencies that you think will go up in the bull market do the opposite it's like the opposite of what I just said like do not use small amounts of money and instead use more than what you what you used to put in the bear market use bigger amounts of money and you put them in like fewer cryptocurrencies not like a huge group but fewer so you can have a lot of uh, a lot of reward it's more beneficial and it's more profitable this way um, that's pretty much everything I need and I want to say in this video Thank you guys so much for watching my videos i appreciate all the comments all the engagement you guys leave under my videos and if you like this video please give it a like and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't and also turn on the notification bell if you like these kind of videos about cryptocurrency and uh, i also do reviews on projects that i think have good potential and profitable 
uh, values so make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can receive my content and benefit from my reviews as well thank you guys so much for watching this video and i hope i catch you on the next